Hey everyone, it's Friday, which means it's time once again for Top 5 Friday. And this week, we're taking a look at video game weapons that weren't necessarily the most effective or most badass, but were just the funniest. Because when I murder people in a video game, I like to do it in a way that makes me giggle. So here's 5 weapons that accomplish just that. Five. Coming in at number 5 on the list is the Electrified Blanca Head from Dead Rising 2. I actually thought it was really funny that you could just put a Blanca head on any enemy and then beat the crap out of them afterwards. But in true Dead Rising form, you can make this weapon even more awesome by giving it an electric charge and making it shoot sparks everywhere, in a nod to everyone's favorite Street Fighter character. Sorry Horde of Zombies, but you're no match for Blanca Zombie Electro Man thing. Also, Blanca Zombie dies too, which is kinda nice. Four. Number 4 on the list is the Skid Loader from Battlefield. Alright, technically it's a vehicle, but vehicles count as weapons, right? I just find it hilarious to see this tiny Skid Loader running around a battlefield full of tanks, choppers, and jet fighters. And managing to run over an enemy and actually get a kill with this thing is the ultimate way to humiliate an enemy. I hope in Battlefield 4 you can actually, like, smash people with the Skid Loader, you know, the little arm in front. Ooh, or a Skid Loader vs Velociraptors mode. That would be awesome. Ah, Postal 2. What a hilariously messed up game. Only in Postal 2 can you drench an enemy in gasoline, light them on fire, and then pee them out. What were the devs thinking? But possibly the most hilarious and simultaneously most f***ed up weapon was the cat assault rifle. You simply stick a cat on the end of your assault rifle, and after a few shots it goes flying at your target. It also acts as a silencer, I guess, but it seems like the cat's meow would draw attention to you. I don't know. Hilarious? Yes. Sick and incredibly messed up? Also, yes, good work, Postal 2. Coming in at number 2 on the list is the Giant Purple Dildo. Now, I think the game that perfected the Giant Purple Dildo was Saints Row the Third, but it's important to remember that the Giant Purple Dildo appeared in GTA before it appeared in Saints Row. Regardless of who came up with this hilarious weapon first, it's hard to come up with a funnier way to beat someone to death. I just think it would be really funny to see the obituaries of people killed by this weapon. Ray Fenton was a quiet man who loved his wife and helped out in the community by building a local homeless shelter. Sadly, on Saturday the 18th of May, he was bludgeoned to death by a man with a gigantic rubber schlong. There will be a brief memorial service on Monday. It will be closed casket. One. And coming in at number one is Mr. Toots from Red Faction Armageddon. If you've never seen this before, it's awesome. It's a unicorn, which I'm partial to, that fires rainbow plasma bolts out of its butt and absolutely obliterates your enemies. Quite possibly the funniest thing about this weapon is the face Mr. Toots makes while you're firing him. If you've played Red Faction Armageddon and you didn't find this awesome easter egg weapon, go turn on the game right now, find an online guide that'll show you where it is, and get Mr. Toots. You will not be sorry. Alright everyone, that is all for this top 5 list. Thanks so much for watching. If there's a top 5 you want to see, be sure and leave it in the comments below, and we'll see you next time.